this snaffle. Uh, it's called a Springsteen snaffle. It's a hinged joint mouthpiece, so it only bends one way. Now it has independent rings, so it can hang. It just hangs flat on the jaw like that. It's nice and wide. I don't know how close I need to be to. So it's nice and wide. It sits across their across their bars very well there, but it's not very obtrusive that way. But it has these spoons underneath, which catch the bottom jaw. So if I'm using it, well, number one, it doesn't have any more nut. It can't have any more nutcracker action than what the bottom jaw actually allows it to have. So that's as much as it can have. It will grab them by the bottom jaw there, but for where I go, where I'm going with my horses, they're, they're going to be either in a hackamore or a bridle at some stage in their life if, if they move out of the snaffle. If they don't move out of the snaffle, it doesn't really matter. But this corresponds to where a, where a hackamore would take a hold of my horse and also where a curb strap or a curb chain takes a hold of my horse. So they're learning that right from day dot. Um, it also takes puts all the pressure right and wraps it right around their jaw rather than just putting it on their bars uh, in a lateral movement so if I'm pulling on just one rein it actually takes a hold of their bottom jaw and takes it with me so they can't it's a bit like having a you know the big bar bits stockman's bits if I pull uh, and it can't it can't slide through their mouth that way um, so yeah if I if I take it laterally it doesn't actually close up on their jaw it doesn't pinch their jaw at all it just takes their whole the whole jaw with it as it goes yeah, so it can't it, there's no way that it can pull through their mouth mm. uh, making it quite a safe bit that way and when I pull on both reins there there I should say um, it can only close up so much okay and it's nice and soft and wide across my Across my hand there there's very little very little nutcracker action there and that's like that it can't get that closed on a horse's jaw okay so anyway that's my favorite um, I will ride them in all sorts of other stuff but that is my that's my go-to snaffle there's no way they you know they can't get any pinching in the corner of their mouth there there is nothing to pinch so you don't end up with those big red cherries on his, on his mouth. So he's had, you know, he's had over a week's worth of driving um, and, you know, being pulled around in a snaffle. There's no cherry there at all in his mouth on either side. Yeah, you know, nice and healthy. So we'll get on with it. Yep.